And going into the ball game tomorrow against UCLA after what many people considered a disappointing loss the first time you played them, how do you see the ball game tomorrow? I think we're a much improved team over the, the team we were when we played them the first time. Uh, you know, we, we get great efforts, efforts from all players, uh, a lot of new players like Marsh and Phil Spencer, adding a lot to the team. And Tommy's playing the best ball of his career. And Monty's always a steady player. We're playing better defense. We're running a lot better. And we're just better overall. I think we'll be ready for this game. I see the ball game well. The game tomorrow should be, you know, you know, people, people before, you know, they, I think they've blown up the uh, UCLA game too much because they said it, you know, it was a rematch of the century and everything. We're going into right now, as Coach Lone says, we're going into the NCAA in, uh, semifinals, and uh, and this is what we've been working for all year, and and the UCLA game is our next game, so that is our most important game to us right now. To be able to get in the finals, we have to beat them. As everybody knows, they have a great team, and so do we. It's just that uh, I don't think I don't think there's any rematch factor in it at all. I think it's an advantage to play a team once before before you you know go into and play them again because because you get sort of used to you, you know you get to know their personnel more and the type of ball they play. So it has been two glorious years together for these two native sons who have shared the spotlight that has a special glow on superstars. Many athletes modestly credit others when lauded for their individual achievements. But there is a genuine sincerity about these two when they speak of Tao, of Stoddard, of Spence, of Rivers, and all the rest whose unity has so often led to victory. If a national championship is to come to Raleigh, it will belong to the team. But these two homegrown heroes will be remembered best among those who made it possible. Whether the next few days bring victory or defeat, they represent an era in North Carolina sports that already reads like a legend. In the years ahead, when their admirers reminisce about unforgettable people, they only need speak the names Tommy and David. That will be enough.